News is continuing to spread about the job that former Senator Christopher Dodd just accepted. That's right. He's been hired to head up the Motion Picture Association of America, a job that comes with a seven-figure salary. News Age Chief Political Correspondent Mark Davis live in our Hartford newsroom with more on exactly what the longtime lawmaker will be doing next. Good evening, Mark. Hi, Keith and Ann. Good evening, everyone, from the Hartford newsroom. Dodd's been in demand for big buck speaking engagement since he left office. As a matter of fact, the Washington Speakers Bureau has him booked to speak in Singapore next week on that financial trade bill, financial restrictions bill that he and Barney Frank wrote here in the U.S. But it's the movie job that will be his main gig. Dodd received an appreciation award today from the Council on Developmental Disabilities for his work on the issue in Congress over 36 years. But the rewards for his new job are what everyone is talking about. He officially starts his new $1.2 million a year job on March 17th and seems very enthusiastic about his new employer. Two and a half million people in our country work in this industry. It's the only American business that has a positive balance of trade in every country in the world. Uh, it's still a product that most of the world wants to see. Even though the CEO of the Motion Picture Association of America is known as the film industry's top lobbyist, Dodd says he will not be lobbying his Senate colleagues in any way. It's against the law. First, and I supported the law, so there's, there's, uh, the, the law is very clear. There's a 24-month cooling off period, and, uh, and, uh, and I intend to, as someone who supported that legislation, and I intend to uh, live by not only the letter of it, but the spirit of it. But Dodd already seems to be lobbying on behalf of the film industry here in Connecticut. He says Governor Dan Malloy should look very carefully before changing the current Connecticut film industry tax breaks because that could scare the business away. You want to measure those things as you make these decisions about uh, what we're willing to cut back on and what we may lose in the process. And Dodd told me he's very, very enthused about his new career path. The issues excited me, the people I was impressed with, and uh, I thought it would be an exciting new chapter and a different path to go down. He says the biggest issue he'll be facing in his new job in the film industry is the estimated $25 billion, that's with a B, $25 billion a year in piracy around the world from the film industry. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, News 8.